It takes endurance. It takes patience. Two things Pierre Davis and his business partner Ken Altman try to be consistent with. They created High Point Logistics, a trucking company, three years ago. Being a small minority company, uh, we need to identify ourselves, let them know that we're here and that we're able to uh, pull freight around here and connect with some of the business owners. Minority and women owned businesses struggle the most for financial help. The eligibility that sometimes that pushes or doesn't allow for these minority companies to be able to take advantage. It's historical marginalization of women owned and minority businesses not having access to capital, not uh, being considered bankable. Dr. Brile Hatch is with Thrive High Point. About five months ago, they began to help 125 women and minority business owners stabilize and grow. And they're operating these small businesses while managing the roles of family and employee, how to also kind of start your business at the same time. Alexis Stuckey is at the beginning of the journey. Getting that name out there, especially when there are so many larger companies, especially in the hair business, that people automatically know and think of. Pierre and Ken say adding employees is crucial for small businesses. You may not be able to compete with employee paychecks big companies offer, but you can give better hours, the ability to work closer to home, and more personal relationships. We want to be appreciated. People want to know that when they go to work, that they, their job really cares about them.